All right, right now I'm going to my quickly climbing routine. The route, uh, if you guys realize, it's freaking hot. So if you ever cycle in the daytime, do hydrate yourself a lot, right? Be sure you have plenty of water. This road will have like a decent amount of uphill and climbs. Mainly it's gonna be NTU climb and then the Lim Chu Kang. Right now it's actually pretty windy. I hope it stays throughout so that I'll feel less of the heat and hopefully enjoy the ride more. It's okay if there's hate wind. I don't hate it. <laughs> Alright. Right, I just enter the NTU. And my climbing routine begins. Overseas, dark emotions ever torn so deep. Here comes the most painful stretch.
Alright guys, I'm at the end of the loop at Lim Tukang Jetty. <sighs> Whew, really shook. You know you had a good climb when you can feel your legs, your thighs, your calves are burning, right? Yeah, it's like damn sore and then you feel the burn. That's when you know you get a very good solid workout. Alright, back to my climb. See you later.
happy. Like probably only 15-20% of the time, it's freaking hot. Other than that, Great, great, just great. Um, I talked like 10 minutes and I realized I didn't record. <laughs> so here we go again. I've completed my climbing road. It's tiring but fun. You can feel all the sore in your legs. To me, I think it's very rewarding because I know I'm gaining even though it's tiring but do have a heart rate monitor because you don't want to overexert your maximum heart rate zone right so really really be careful on that if you guys are curious and want to try this road i strongly recommend for so some point for you guys to take note is try not to ride at night because the dogs are quite active there yeah so it's strongly recommended for you guys to ride in the morning and afternoon. Give it a try. Uh, I'm sure you guys will enjoy it. Do take care of your body. Like as much as you want to train hard. Uh, you should watch your heart rate whenever you climb. Especially the NTU climb I would say. Because NTU climb is the one that is very demanding. So be sure not to cross your maximum heart rate because that is very dangerous it will not benefit you instead it will be detrimental to your health all right so really really be careful about that we have pretty interesting data right here so the total distance is 27.5 and my average speed is 27.5 <laughs> cool right it's a shame that the elevation gain is not 275 it's 264 spend exactly one hour to complete this uh, route we are looking to adopt some sort of a training routine to incorporate into um, the monthly training let me see how it goes from there like give us a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't and do leave us a comment see you again till the next time mm -hmm.